morning everybody so right now I am 7:48 on my way to get a friend drop her off at work then I have to rush from nine nine to get my nephew before 10 o'clock so his mom can go to work at 10 o'clock. <laughs> so, um, yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Then, after I get my nephew, my day gets started, baby. Like, <laughs> let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> like for real, what's good? You hear me? It's a beautiful, beautiful Monday morning. So I hope you guys are starting your day right. I hope you're starting your day um, fantastic. I hope you have a wonderful day. Get your spirits up. Get your good hopes up. It's a beautiful week. A brand new week. Make goals. Make um, plans. Write them down, jot them down. I'm telling y'all, like, I do it every day myself. I don't. That's one thing I'm starting to work on. But, improvement, baby. Improvement. Elevation at its finest. You hear me? Like, yes. We got to rise and elevate all 2021. Ain't no, ain't no down and out. It's up and better. Up and better. But, um, yeah. So, what we do today, I have no idea. I have a lot on my mind to do today, um, but I don't want to keep my nephew in the car all day. Like, I don't want that at all. I don't like being in the car all day myself, so I'm not going to keep a infant in the car all day. And yes, y'all are probably like, why you keep calling this little boy an infant? Because although he's not truly, truly, truly an infant, he's not a toddler yet. So, an infant makes sense. An infant only makes sense. Oh, get that smell of Jordan, baby! <laughs> but, I made a bowl of cereal. As you guys saw in the previous clip, I made a bowl of cereal. I ate that. I made some tea. I drank that. Um, Washed my teeth, <laughs> washed my face. I did not film that part, but <coughs> I washed my face a little bit. I didn't moisturize my face though, and I'm now about to eat a nectarine. Um, nectarine, peaches, mangoes, fruit. I guess you could say I'm a morning person on fruit. Like, give me fruit and I will wake up happier than I went to sleep. You hear me? Like, I don't know. I just feel like, I feel like fruits are the best way to start your day. You cannot make this right turn on red. Why do y'all keep doing that? It says no right turn on red anyway. Now you can go. Like, oh, y'all just don't know. It's my favorite. It's what I do all day long. All day long. Pretty much what I do all day long to drive. But people can't drive. Like, they think, oh, I gotta follow the rules of the road today. Like, ugh. Yeah, that's not how the rules of the road work. That's why they have rules of the freaking road. Y'all fail to realize that. Y'all fail to follow that. But I'm on my way to my friend. I'm gonna eat this in peace.
everybody be like, how you do? I don't, I don't know. Like, I don't know. God, like, y'all don't realize I don't sleep. My mind constantly turns. Y'all looking back here like, that's a dirty edge window. It is, it is. But it's all right because I think I'm going to take care of that today. I think. I don't know. I'm not a hundred percent sure yet. But I think I'm going to take care of that today. about 30 minutes ago and my brother woke him up so now he's really knocked out knocked out um i'm washing some of his laundry and then i was in the process of cleaning this machine or putting water in that but i can't now so i have to order a whole new piece um so yeah this looks like it's gonna go in the trash or it's somewhere else i have no idea but yeah um And now I'm about to go clean up um, upstairs and rearrange the trunk of my car while he is asleep and does not need my complete and full attention. But now he will be asleep for a while, so I'm going to have a little bit of time for this. Not much, but a little bit. Bluetooth connection is successful. Bluetooth disconnect. Alright guys, so I'm showing y'all my trunk. My trunk was dirtier than mm -hmm. this. It had all of this stuff sitting in it. 
um, nothing dirty, but, you know, I just wanted to clean it out, because I cleaned up the rest of my car two couple days ago, um, so back here, I've got my first aid kit, and then in here, in this, what is a Postmate bag, I have my car parts, so for changing a tire, well, this is a jumping cable set, but everything else down there is for changing a tire, or it needs to be blocked up on a hill, or something like that to keep them rolling. Here is my nephew's toys um, that I'm putting in there. So far, he's just got balls in there. Um, these are my shoes. I don't know if I can take them in the house or not. But then I've got my old work equipment in here. I'm going to find a bag or tote or something to put in here to put the rest of my stuff in it. Um, and I say that because that um, part really differentiates between whether I'm sitting between where I'm working at so if I'm working at a nursing home I want to put all stuff back there for the nursing home hold on and if I am working at like a factory job like Amazon UPS or something like that I will put the materials that I need to work there and back there as well um but yes y'all so I cleaned out my car the other day so now all I have to do is wipe down my seats I want to shampoo the carpet but I'm not going to do that right now just because that takes all day and I don't have any baking soda to throw down um on the carpet so yeah but it's not too bad. It's not shabby looking in here or anything. But my seats are laid back because I have these nephews that sleep in my car. They fall asleep in my car. And This foot healer's cream, foot cream, I wish I hadn't have bought it because I didn't need it for real for real. Mm -hmm. um, then I've got some baby clothes. And y'all thinking, why you got baby clothes? Well, because my sister's having a baby girl, her first child, her first daughter. Um, so I got her some outfits. She's not born yet, but I got her some outfits. We got her shoes. This is six to nine months, by the way, or so it says. But the shoes say size three, um, six to nine months. I don't think I'm six to or nine months old in the way shoes. But I like the shirt says sweet baby girl and then the pants and then I got her um this set Valentine's Day says love mm -hmm. and it's a six to nine months She's going to be born in October. So I was like, well, six to nine months should be a side by time um, Valentine's Day gets you. And she was a Valentine's Month baby. So kind of special and sweet. But I think I'm going to get her a onesie or something and put something else on the butt. But this is cute. And then, I got her this one, it's just like the other one, but in pink. Can't never go wrong with two. And the month of love, can't never go wrong with it. Then I got her this deal to three months, um, made in Bangladesh onesie, and it says meow gold and black and brown which I don't know how I got out to with this because yeah, I don't know how the fuck they're going to take that off but we'll figure it out I guess got the little feet and that's the zero to three months I don't know if I said that already then I got her some headbands um, they were so cute this is the last pack I picked up. They're only three dollars. Um, teal-ish 
white and pink, tealish white and pink, and then I got these ones that match the one outfit I showed you, pink, white, with a polka dotted bow, and hot pink at the bottom, so that for her, and then I also got her, all of that was at Dollar General. This item here is from Ross. I just gonna tell you, and the thing it was five dollars. It's a Zach and Zoe plush bathrobe for newborn for nine months. And then I've also got a few older sizes for her. I don't know if she's gonna wear them by then. Um, then I had got that's a shoe. This is again everything from the trunk. Some of the stuff I bought, some of the stuff I didn't buy or I bought weeks ago, weeks and weeks ago. Um, this I had got at Walmart. I believe it was Walmart. The Joy. Um, Razors, razor, I should say. Um, it's only one. Then I have got this at Walmart for four dollars. It's this LED curtain set, curtain lights. Um, I want to hang them up, but my basement, as far as I know, does not have. Oh, I might have to plug for this. I might be able to hang this up down here. I'm not too sure. Um, we'll come back to that one, and then I have picked up something else that I don't really want to disclose to you all because it happened. Um, then I got some Epsom salt. Some Epsom salt. I need this so bad. Um. But I got this to release achy feet. It's to leave his foot soak. So I'm going to put this in my stash. Good for my feet. Um, so everything else that was in the car is this. The bean bag. It's a heatable bean bag. I don't know if I'm going to toss it out or keep it. Um, like I said, a lot of this was already in the car, so I'm pretty sure I have to wash these two items, but yes, I do. Um, one of my nephew's shirts, and one of his bibs, and that's crazy because I've already got stuff that he's going through the washer right now. Um, and I didn't see that. Then I've got, if you're a girl, you understand, keep his damp on me. Always in the car, you understand that? And then I've got some important papers. Uh, then I've got my mask I have. I'm actually going to um, get another tub. That's why I don't know if I'm going to put the ottoman back in the car or if I'm going to put the ottoman on one of the sides of the bed that I don't really have room for. Um, and put, like, safety stuff like mask and glove because I have tons of those. But I hate having, like, them just in the car by themselves. So if I don't do that, I'm going to end up using... This basket that I had bought for, I believe, the car actually, anyway. Um, but I like more sturdier things. That's not, yeah, I had bought this for the car because it says sand in it. But when I went to Florida in, in April, I believe it was. But, uh, yeah, so there's that. Then I've got my big old purse. And what's in it, honestly, is nothing that, like, 
um, should not, not be in my purse, but we're going to clean my purse out anyway, so I've got my wallet, hi Buddha, and then I've got my breathing, um, stuff, hang on Bubba, I'm going to run upstairs and grab his, um, bottle, because I'm pretty sure that's what he wants. And then I've got my keys that I threw in there, never usually in my purse. Um, this is also never usually in my purse with the video charger. I put the thing down here somewhere. Um, this is also, it's only been in my purse the last couple of months because I've been working a lot. Um, well, I'm not working no more. But Lynch, the game Lynch. Hold on. Um, then I have one of my medications. I'm actually going to keep it in there because there's only two left. It's a Brio medication. Um, and I've got trash, trash. I think more trash, to be honest. Or papers and stuff that. Yeah, I've got some good RX cards, so if people don't have any, they can get their medicine with that. I've got some big old, i got another one. <laughs> wow. I've got some big old post-it notes um, that I've been trying to keep stuff on. Sometimes I'll do it by either card. Sometimes I won't. Um, what else is in here? A lighter. A charger to a bunch of stuff. Um, headphones, a pen, headphones, Bluetooth headphones, wireless headphones, whatever, mouthwash, a pair of socks, lotion. Makeup kit, makeup wipes, antiseptic make makeup wipes, um, comb, hand sanitizer. I don't like this brand. I bought this like a year and a half ago, and I still this bottle still how it is. So I think I'm gonna em actually empty this into something else and pour the one that I actually used in there because that's disgusting. Um, I don't like the way that smells. Trash. Um, let's see what else is in here. Another pair of headphones. <laughs> Told you I'd be having trash and headphones in here. Shea butter, lotion. I did a haul on that a few months ago. Trash. Poop medicine. Because I have the worst at being counterfeited. A sock. Trash. And what is this? Trash. This is trash. Let's keep going because I'm not done. I have a trash. Um, it's one of those things that go on coffee cups. More trash. Yep, they're in the side pocket now. A lip gloss I made. Lip therapy, lip balm for chapped lips. A tea from a hotel. What's wrong, duty? Okay. Um, don't know how this came about, but this is an old hearing aid, so I'm gonna put this back and put it in a different bag. Um, hearing aid, ear mold, lip shiner, I guess you can call it. 
Oh no, it's perfume. Roll on perfume. Um, permanent marker ink. Not done. Pop socket. Trash. Another lighter. Mm, about four more pins. So I've had five mm -hmm. pins on this out in, on the inside of the purse. What's on the outside of the purse? Outside pocket of the purse. Trash. One thing they tell you not to get into. Um, chapstick. Six pin. First on the outside, a card, playing game card, a whole different deck of playing game cards. And I've got change. 25, 50, 65, 66 cents. Mm -hmm. So guys, that was everything that was in my purse, in the back of my car, and what I've recently bought. Um, so now what I'm going to do is clean this, organize it, and I will get back to you. <coughs> On the baby items, um, I'm going to, I believe, wrap them up. Actually, I think I'm going to store them in the ottoman for now, and then, because I have a few more, I have a couple weeks left until I have to wrap everything and get it prepared for a baby shower, so, that's that, that is the gist of my afternoon so far, and I found my, one of my jackets I have in my car, which also needs to be washed. Um, so now I'm going to attempt to put this together and figure out where I want it to go. Again, I got this at Dollar General. Dollar General might as well just sponsor me at this point. If I've been on, if I were to have done YouTube for as long as I've shopped at Dollar General, Dollar General would be sponsoring me right about now. Like, literally. It's fifteen dollar ottoman. I think I got it for ten dollars actually. But here we go. It's a foldable ottoman, and I like that. But I think I'm gonna hate the other thing. So. Because it all fits, all of this is folded up like this on the inside of whoop, on the inside of the chair. Oh damn. Hold on, y'all. I have that, that one. And that was the good one. Okay. down. 
I left my front screen like an open. I guess the lid didn't on it. It keeps it open. Shit. Like that. And then I guess you just put the lid on it. Does nothing come out of the lid? Oh. Haha, <laughs> this comes out of the lid. So if you're over 250 pounds, don't sit on it. If you're, um, yeah, really that. If you're over 250 pounds, don't sit on it. I don't know what else to say other than that. But y'all, y'all, this girl just got the money. This girl just got the money. You got 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 just got the money. Yeah, I cut these up in half size. Like the noodles are so fast, I cut in half, but I really don't. Got a whole lot to chew.
I'm a fool, Jules, I know it.
extremely, extremely bored. I'm thirsty.